2014, we started as a group that was doing different forms of agriculture. We were in cereal value chain, where we, were, we used to grow uh, maize in Solai and other uh, vegetables in other areas such as Kinangop. Because of the high demand that uh, is experienced in the fisheries, where most of the people in Nakuru uh, take their fish from either Lake uh, Victoria in Kisumu or Lake Naivasha, we decided to start the fish farming venture because uh, over the past few years uh, there has been a lot of demand among uh, people with children and people who want to practice healthy living. So that is the motivation that uh, drove Green Thumb into fish farming. We have a lot of ICT equipment individually, not as a group, but we didn't know how we could apply it in agribusiness. So that was one of the major needs and Vijabiz has met that because we did an entire three day of ICT training. It has also met the needs where we had a lot of uh, group dynamics, uh, group living, uh, group members living, others coming in without the same commitment, but through the different trainings we've been able to, to reach uh, our goal where we have a stable number of members right now. As a young person, it has made a major impact in my life because uh, I've realized um, agri agriculture is not a dirty job. You can, you can do it even in a small space and uh, it's very profitable and uh, it's a good source of yeah, income. In the near future, uh, I can say that uh, the group uh, will probably do well, but that depends on you know, how they carry on from here going forward. Uh, but as it is, the group is doing really well and uh, I think uh, they, they have an opportunity to grow into a big, you know, enterprise that can be into, incorporated into a company and, you know, start, you know, just um, uh, having business and doing business out there as a, in a registered company. I would recommend uh, they should use uh, this, the groups they have taught as uh, models to reach a, a wider range of people and teaching them about agribusiness and their value chains.